All right, so we're here, Universal Studios, mm -hmm. with the queen of misfits herself. You ain't got the belt, but I, she's I the mean, champ. I get uh, I get bullied quite hard for taking the belt everywhere that I go, so I thought I would leave it. You got leave it alone for this a time. Bit. Yeah. Makes sense. <laughs> Astrid, what? The breakdown. I got some questions for you. Uh huh. So why don't we go ask some Let's around the entire park? You ready? Yeah. This is a, a completely different setting to what we're used to. What happened there we there? go. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. Coming off the championship win, mm -hmm. obviously we didn't get to talk much. We were actually supposed to do an interview after that we fight. We were, yeah. I, was, I had yeah, to go. Yeah. You Tell had to me go. about the immediate thoughts. You had the blacked up face and the red eyes and the whole thing. Yeah, I mean, my vision was really bad after that, actually. Yeah. I, I spoke to the doctor twice. Yeah. So I was really concerned because she was just punching me in the eye socket, yeah. which was really new. <laughs> like, when I've been sparring and when I've yeah. been in previous fights, everyone always goes for the chin. Yeah. Because that's what knocks you out, right? Right. So yeah, I was really surprised when she was. Wait, could she crack? Was she hitting pretty hard? No, which no. Was, it was just inconvenient. Yeah, okay. yeah, like well, I've seen her previous fights. Yeah. And um, she kept her lead hand out quite a lot to kind of power up the right. Yeah. Which is what I was expecting. Show me that again. <laughs> she was just like. <laughs> you turned it over. What do you mean? Your right hand. Show me. Hey, okay. Yeah. She was just, she was just keeping her hand out. So yeah. In training, I'd practice like if you put your hand out. I practiced like just batting the hand down and right. then going, and um, yeah, she didn't do that. She was just bringing. She was swinging. She was swinging. Yeah, this right hand was like Boom. coming over. Okay, so and it's just not what I was expecting. Right. So I was a bit disappointed with that fight. I can't lie. I come off of it, and my, even my coach said that's probably thirty percent of what you could have done. So it's just so hard in the moment to like regain yourself and and kind of just do what you've been training to do in a fight. It's just such a different circumstance as you get yeah. to. So yeah, it, it was good. Obviously, I still won. Um, I do think she won the first round just because she came out swinging and I was not expecting it. Yeah, yeah. She landed a good few shots. So I think she won the first round. I do remember going back into my corner and my coach literally saying like, if you win this round, you win the whole fight. Yeah. Like you have to go for it now. Like this is it. So. Yeah, in the last round, that's when I was like, I just have to be smart about it now and, yeah. and really go in there and come out with the belt. So, yeah. You're happy. giving her the old, like, bah, bah, <laughs> smack, hammer fist. Like, yeah. You're like, fuck this, I'm just going to win. Yeah, literally. I mean, I'm yeah. doing everything I can yeah. right now, yeah. I told her mom that I was soon. I was soon. So, so you get the win. Yeah. Obviously, you got all healed up. You're looking gorgeous again, you know. Thanks. Um, <laughs> So what's next? I heard you were supposed to fight potentially in May. That didn't, yeah, that didn't happen yeah, yeah. or it's not happening? I was supposed to fight in May. Okay. Um, kind of bummed out that I'm not. Yeah. But we kind of established or realized that the opponent that I wanted to fight wasn't going to be ready. Okay. Or, you know, there was just a few like little bits that just wasn't going to work. At first, Mams kind of said he didn't want me to go into it too soon after the March fight because I was so battered yeah yeah it makes sense yeah they kind of said we're not sure if you're going to be ready for may okay um but i literally healed after a week oh Hon wow honestly like i went you to got that super soldier serum yeah, okay yeah literally i don't know what happened i went to barbados just to have a little bit of a break Flex, okay yeah. <laughs> yeah i just went to barbados for a little yeah, bit yeah i just went deal. to barbados and yeah the sun the sea the sand maybe that's the, what did it the pina coladas yep yeah. healed me that place healed me there you so. go yeah, I was fine, so I said to Mams, you know, I think I'm good for May. Yeah. I'm healed, I'm ready, I'm excited to get back into training. Okay. But um, May just didn't work, so hoping now, it'll be sometime in the summer. Okay. Yeah, in okay. the summer you'll see me again. So, at the moment I'm just enjoying doing uh, stuff like this. I was gonna say, who has been the most fun to hang out with? I know you're doing a lot of content with a lot of fighters, stuff like that. But let's be honest, who's the most fun to hang out with? Um, Dean the Great is always a laugh. But just because he's, he's, <laughs> let me get there, let me get okay, there, let me ahead. get there. I'm making a point. Dean the Great is, is always nah, a good Nah, Dean's laugh. the man, he's my guy. Yeah, he's funny. Uh, but I'm not gonna lie, this has been amazing today. Let's be real. I mean, the setting, the stuff that we've been doing, we've been going on some roller coasters. Yes. Uh, we're going which to go I'm on a terrified of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll probably put some. He's literally in just doing like this. <laughs> <laughs> the whole time he's on the ride. <laughs> he's like, I'm not even going to look. Make me up. look like I'm taking a shit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm like, ah. Uh. Yeah, like, uh. <laughs> no, 
you. We had fun. We've had fun. It's been great. It's been what great I, fun. What I do want to know is, did you get a chance? Now, you were at Misfits number six. Yes. You also got a chance to watch Kingpin? Uh, I didn't watch the fights. Okay. Uh, I watched them after. I did okay. uh, me, uh, a few people in Minicon, um, and some people sat down and watched a few of the fights. Yeah. Um, and yeah, it was it was a good what'd event. You, I was gonna say, what do you think? What do you? Are, is our yeah. debut on Kingpin, the Breakdown Boys taking over all pretty much I mean, production responsibilities. What do yeah. you think? Yeah. I mean, you always smash it. You do such a good job on Misfits that I'm not surprised that Kingpin wanted you over there. You did a great job. Appreciate it. What yeah. about Sensei though? Yeah. I mean, it's good to have him back. Yeah. Like he wasn't there when I was. Uh, doing all the misfits bits. Yeah. So yeah, it's great to have him back. He always gets so so gassed and you know, he's proper into it. Like I, I can't remember who it was that we watched, but he was literally like so excited. He oh, was yeah. like He's so, jazzed up. Yeah, yeah, he's now, great to watch. I do wanna know you didn't watch a lot of the Kingpin event, but did you see the, the semifinals matchups for men and women? I wanna I wanna focus on the women. Did you see the the I, women's side? I didn't I'll let you know what, what it was. Uh, yeah, tell me. L Brook is going to be fighting who, who is l fighting actually is that the she's fighting the girl with the big legs i don't think she's fighting julie is she is she fighting julie i know emily's i thought emily was fighting julie and maybe not though i don't know yeah i don't know i didn't emily, see the matchups regardless the two brooks sisters you've seen them yes they're on different sides of the bracket so are they gonna could they potentially, potentially. fight each other yeah potentially you're getting a finals matchup that is so weird yeah do you know, now, so I know weird. you know Elle. Do you know Emily at all? Or have you talked to her before or not? Uh, no, I haven't spoken to her. I mean, I know who she is. I know that she's right. her sister. But no, I've never spoken to her. I never really had any correspondence. Yeah, um, yeah I don't know. I mean, I, I think obviously she's seen how well the, the fighting does and her sister being obviously quite yeah. successful in it. Like, why wouldn't you get involved? So, yeah, uh, fair enough. Zone. Zone. I told ma that I was soon. Soon. Here's a question for you. Uh-huh. You asked me about potentially who wins a Jake Paul KSI matchup. I got to throw the one right back at you. <laughs> this is obviously something that's big in our scene. People have been talking about it for years. Yeah. Potentially you might get the fight this year. Yeah. Who wins that fight? KSI, Jake Paul, and why? It depends when. If they fought right now, Jake. You know, he's, he's dedicated so much time and effort and yeah. into fighting, and I think the thing is with boxing is a lot of professional boxers, they're very skilled, obviously, very, very skilled athletes. But I think skill can only take you so far. Yeah, Megatron's out here. Yeah, we were interrupting looking for you. I know, oh, shush, mate. I'll keep you up. Basically, me in Transform transformer version. form, yeah. I am Mega Megatron. Megatron. <laughs> Mega I am Mega Wade. Mega but no. Wade. Mega so you Don. think Jake wins right now? Right now. When would, what, what's the time frame in which KSI can make up that ground, though? Uh, I mean, I think I assumed that they were going to fight in December. Which everybody did. Right? I think then, it may, if he had dedicated like uh, all of his time into into fighting like Jake has, yeah. then it could be a very, very close matchup. But, you know, it, it's so weird to kind of think about who wins because they both have so much to lose. Yeah, big time. Do you know time. what I mean? So big I time. think no matter what, they are both going to do anything that they possibly can to win. Thanks. And I don't know, it might even be a close one. It might just be on points. Yeah, I know everybody wants to go for that knockout. Yeah. But, oh. I got to ask you something that Leon Will said, and it wasn't said to you, but it was said generally. And I, I, I think it's a fascinating thing to bring up now. Because I think he's flat wrong, but I do want to ask you, do you, do you see the comment Lee, Leon made uh, a couple of weeks ago? No. It was on Twitter, and it was about Jezebels and Harlots being the ones that are coming into women's influencer boxing. Okay. I said, why is that, why, why, why is that the most girls that do this? And Sensei had a great point. But before I tell you that, what, what do you think of just that comment? I mean... I think it's good that obviously more girls are coming into the scene anyway. Yeah. But yeah, I feel like me and some other girls should have a bit of recognition into that. Like, a bit, yeah. There's already girls in the scene. And, yeah. You know, we've we fought a few times now. I feel yeah. like, we, yeah, I don't know. I, don't, I think he was bringing it up to be like, why don't we have more girls that aren't doing OnlyFans doing it? And I right. think the, 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 the proper response is because you guys are almost bulletproof. You, you guys have been you guys have been poked at for years. No pun intended, but you've been <laughs> with you've fingers. Been, yeah, you've been you know the online community is as 
thrown some shade your guys away for a long time. You're mentally yeah. able to deal with a lot of that. Yeah, yeah, So yeah. fighting is just that progression. By the way, speaking of progression. We are in Super Mario We're in the, we're in the Mushroom Kingdom right yeah, now. Yeah, we are. This is, this is unreal. Real quick, name me five Mario characters without thinking. Go. Uh, Mario, Luigi, Princess Peach, Bowser, and... She's choking! Bah! She's choking! Uh, who else is there? Boy? Who else? Mushroom hat? We said it earlier. It's like another name for a frog. She's never gonna get it. No, I'm never gonna get it. Toad! What did you say oh, Toad. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, man. But I was literally like. Oh, and Yoshi! She's looking right and at it. I was literally looking at it. And Yoshi! <laughs> she said Yoshi. There's Yoshi. Yoshi. Oh, no. Like, yo, it is Yoshi. No, it's Yoshi. Two O's, Yoshi. Or no, it is one O. It yeah, is one it's o. one O. It's not Yoshi. All right, well, Yoshi. listen. This is our version of the walk and talk. I got one more question for you. When would you like to see me step in and fight? I mean, that's something I don't want to wait for. I want to see that tomorrow. I think that's going to be so entertaining. It just depends who. Is that I was going to say, I was, who, who? Who's that guy that holds the balloon? I'm just thinking height-wise. The guy that holds the balloon? You know the scary looking one? Are you calling me Slenderman? Because I've, I've heard that a couple times now. <laughs> I said that to you on the phone! I said that to you on the phone. Um, who would I like to see you fight? The guy that holds balloons? I have no idea. Oh, Charlie, I'm, what's she talking about? I haven't seen you training. I'm trying to think of people that might height, be similar size, height. Right. Yeah. Maybe Slim? Slim, probably a little bit too small. Slim's about 160, I'm about 200 pounds. Oh, uh, okay, yeah. But JMX has been one. JMX would be good, yeah. yeah. He just lost as well, so maybe that would be a good little yeah, matchup. Yeah, for sure. Your first fight, him trying to come back. Yeah. Yeah, Slim, JMX, um, Minicon's far too big. Way too big. I yeah. don't want no parts of Minicon. Please stop. <laughs> I don't want to eat those punches. Hell no. No, no. What about you, though? Oh, we got you... mine done. Yeah. Who do you want in your next fight? Potentially, if there's names out there you want to call out, anybody. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm always calling out Elbrook, but I just don't think with the weight, she does not want to come down. And it's kind of weird because when we first yeah. agreed to fight, yeah. we were always going to fight at 52 kg. So she can be that way. Right. She just won't. Um, so other than her, people that are my weight. Yeah, we got to get that one though, man. I know, everybody so wants it. So much spice on there. There's a, that's a big fight. You guys at the at the press conference when she was fighting Faith, going yeah, back and yeah, forth, yeah, yeah, yeah. you said stop eating the burgers, well, I fatty. Think, I, <laughs> I didn't say fatty. Quit eating the burgers, you fatty. Yeah, keep put the burgers down, come fight me. You fat fuck. Oh, you're making sense. <laughs> Why are you going Irish? <laughs> I'm going Irish in the middle of it. But no, Man, who else though? Who Is else? there anybody out there there's that a can few, challenge the champ? There's a few people that are running their mouths on social media. Oh. I'm not going to lie. Okay. I'm not going to say anything here. Well, but the champ doesn't give credit to the people coming up. They got to they gotta fight their way to the champ. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But there's no one my weight. Who's my weight that I can fight? Girls, get the guns ready. Get the weight together. Come see the champ. Yeah. Come Appreciate you. I, I want to do, the, I wanna do the, uh, the salt poppy intro or the salt poppy outro. I want the... What did you say to him? You said, "Oh, you got a girlfriend." He was like, "I said, I, I never, I never." Oh, see you tried to, you tried to hug him at the end. Yeah, I said, "I never see you hanging around with like a girl. Do you need a girlfriend?" And he was like, "I already have one." I was like, "Okay." And they all signed off. He get, he dapped you yeah, up. Yeah, I was like, I went in for a hug, and he was like, oh. "It's the best video on the Breakdown channel." And she's not even the host. Well, you kind of are. You're a host of the Breakdown. Yeah, a little Guest bit. Host. I did a little bit. Maybe we'll get her again next time. It's been Asher Wet. Your boy Wade Sensei, where you at, man? This is a video He's without you. Again. He's not here again. I'm pulling more weight than he I ever like could. I like it better when there's two men. <laughs> you heard it here first. The breakdown, boys. We'll see you guys next time. I can't take no loss. I don't even know what it costs. I hit the ground and I